Welcome back, race fans. Today, we've got some exciting updates from the world of Formula One, and it involves a major shift in the leadership at Haas F1 team. So grab your racing gear, hit that subscribe button, and let's dive into it. In a meeting room at Haas's UK headquarters, not far from the iconic Silverstone circuit, Ayo Komatsu, the recently appointed team principal, is gearing up for a new era at Haas F1 team. Ayo Komatsu steps into the limelight, taking over from the charismatic Gunther Steiner, known for his unintentional stardom on Netflix's Drive to Survive. Does not fox smash my door. But Komatsu is quick to make one thing clear. He's not trying to be Gunther Steiner. So Haas is at a crossroads, and Gene Haas, the team owner, isn't settling for anything less. Unhappy with the recent performances, he's made a bold move to move to Komatsu, who was previously the director of engineering is now tasked with injecting a technical focus needed to steer Haas in a new direction. In a rare interview with F1.com, Gene Haas expressed his disappointment with the team's performance, despite their close ties to Ferrari. Five consecutive years in the bottom three of the Constructors' Championship and a rock-bottom finish in 2023, Haas needed a change. The departure from Steiner's leadership marks a significant moment for Haas. Steiner, the face of the team's formation is stepping aside, presenting Komatsu with a unique challenge. But Komatsu's appointment is intentional and a deliberate departure from Steiner's approach. While Komatsu shares some leadership traits with Steiner, such as being direct and avoiding politics, he's aiming for more of a focus and less flamboyant approach. Can't lie, I loved Gunther. So going forward, no excessive exposure. Sorry, Netflix. Instead, the primary focus now is on improving competitiveness. Haas gained attention initially with its unique collaboration model, sourcing car parts from Ferrari. But times have changed. Challenges arose in 2023 with a car struggling with tire degradation, Komatsu identifies weakness in the team's geographical divide, particularly the split between the UK and Italy. This, he believes, hindered car development and is part of his ongoing review. Now, what about the upcoming F1 season? Well, Komatsu is cautious about revealing specific plans, but emphasizes commitment to improving competitiveness. The new car, set for a shakedown at Silverstone February 11th, represents a step forward. However, Komatsu acknowledges it may not be enough to compete with rivals due to a late season design change in 2023. The focus for 2024, showcasing improvements and stability. So there you have it, folks. A new chapter for Haas F1 under Ayo Komatsu's leadership. Will there changes bring them back to the top? Only time will tell. Make sure to like this video, share your thoughts in the comments, and stay tuned for more thrilling F1 updates. Until next time, keep those engines roaring.